Bratislava, Slovakia, Felix Agurilia Seam lifted Canada into the Davis Cup final, downing Norbert Gombos of Slovakia 6-3, 6-4 on Saturday to win the best of five tie 3-2. It was the second win of the day in three matches for the Canadians, who trailed 2-1 after losing in doubles 3-6, 7-5, 6-3 to open Saturday's action. Felix Agurilia seems Roar gets a reaction from Denis Shapovalov, second from right, and the rest of Canada's Davis Cup team after Saturday's dramatic victory over Slovakia and Bratislava. Vladimir S. I. M. I. C. E. K. Getty Images Denis Shapovalov of Richmond Hill forced a deciding fifth match when he defeated Martin Klizan 7-6, 4-6-4, giving Montreal's Agurilia seem the chance to close it out. Shapovalov and Agurilia seem played all five of Canada's matches. The 19-year-old Shapovalov is ranked no. 25 Agurilia seem, who doesn't turn 19 until August, is the youngest player in the top 200 at no. 106 Agurilia seem, making his Davis Cup debut at NTC Arena, broke Gombos for a 5-4 lead in the second set and held serve to win it. A jubilant Canadian team, led by Agur Eliasim draped in the Canadian flag, climbed into the stands to celebrate with fans. Agur Eliasim won 82% of his first service points and converted on two of four break points against his 255th ranked opponent. The match lasted 1 hour, 29 minutes. Canada will play in the Davis Cup final in Madrid in November. Shabibalov needed 1 hour, 45 minutes to dispatch the no. 38 Klizan, firing 6 aces and 22 total winners while winning 70% of his first service games. He gave Canada an early edge in the series on Friday, beating Philip Haransky in the first singles match. But Klizan downed Augur seemed to not the clay court series at a win apiece and the Slovaks beat the young Canadians in doubles in the first match Saturday, 3-6, 7-5, 6-3. The Canadian team, captained by Frank Danchevich, was missing no. 15 Milos Ronick of Thornhill and number 94 Vasek Pospisil of Vancouver, who underwent back surgery last month. Daniel Nestor of Toronto, a double star who was a mainstay on the Davis Cup team for years, retired last year. It marked the first time since 1997 that Slovakia and Canada had met in a Davis Cup. Slovakia won that time, 4-1 in Montreal. Report an error journalistic standards about the star sports action and reaction delivered to your inbox, new N-E-W-S-L-E-T-T-E-R-S-P-O-R-T-S-S-I-G-N up.